Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Unlock Your Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICIC Mathematics Class 7 Chapter 18 Percentage and its Applications Exercise 18 F Question number 5. This is find the sum which will amount to 165.75 in 3 whole 1 by 2 years at 3% per annum simple interest. Right Now, what do we have to do here is we have to find the sum sum or you can say simply the principal sum right so we need to find the principal that is p i'll just write it here for p right this is what we don't know and we have to find okay now few things are given that is which will amount to so amount to means the amount right keep this in mind so the amount will be 165.75 right this becomes our amount rupees 165.75 okay now it says in three whole one by two years again three whole one by two years is our time so the time that we get becomes what three whole one by two years or simply you can convert this into a uh, mixed uh, an improper fraction so this will become seven upon two years right now again the rate also is given so rate is what the rate is 3% per annum right 3% per annum now here you can see that we can we can use one formula that is for finding the amount right we will not use the formula for finding simple interest here because we don't know the principle only right and that will prove uh, somewhere wrong that will be a longer process right I'll I'll do it with a shorter one see we know that the amount right the amount equals to the principal plus the simple interest okay now with this we will derive a formula that is amount equals to p will be as it is and in brackets okay we can or basically outside you can say right simply don't write the brackets now p and plus will be already there now si si formula for si is PRT upon 100 principal rate time upon 100 this we know so we can write this as PRT upon 100 as well right we can write this simple interest becomes this one basically the formula of itself right now this you see P is coming two times so for clearing this problem we we assume one P that is principal once as one and the other principal as the variable keep this in mind so the amount equals to p and in brackets this p will become 1 plus rt will be as it is upon 100 rest thing will be as it is and close the brackets right again multiplication will change to plus here keep this in mind this p becomes this one this p as it is and rest is the same now with this only we'll find our uh, principle see how amount we know that is 165.75 so substituted 165.75 equals to Again, we do not know the principle, so keep it as P for now. Then 1 will be as it is because it is a constant. R and T, R is the rate that is 3% per annum. So simply 3 into T, T is time 7 upon 2. Again, upon 100, right? Sorry, not on this one, right? This upon will not be on this one. Just R rate and time. Don't put it on the one, okay? And then we can close this bracket here. Now, solve this up. So 165.75 equals to P in brackets 1 plus 3 into 7, 21 upon 2 into 1 upon 100, right? This is what it will be. See why? Because 3 and 2 cannot be cancelled, 7 and 2 cannot be cancelled. So we directly multiply 3 and 7, that gives us 21 upon 2 will be as it is into now this division changes to multiplication okay and this 100 will be reciprocated so on reciprocating 100 we get 1 upon 100 so into 1 upon 100 keep this in mind then again nothing can be cancelled here so just solve this ordinary way 165.75 equals p 1 plus 21 upon 200 again what will this give you on solving see here 165.75 equals to principal in brackets 1 becomes 200 right p 
प्लस ट्वेंटी वन अपॉन सॉरी राइट दिस इज ट्वेंटी नॉट टू हंड्रेड कीप दिस इन माइंड टू इंटू वन हंड्रेड टू हंड्रेड राइट एंड टू हंड्रेड प्लस ट्वेंटी वन अपॉन टू हंड्रेड ओके वाई टू हंड्रेड बिकॉज दिस वन कैन बी रिटर्न एज वन अपॉन वन एज वेल सो एल सी एम ऑफ दिस वन एंड टू हंड्रेड एल सी एम ऑफ वन एंड टू हंड्रेड विल बी टू हंड्रेड ओके सो वॉट विल हैपन दिस वन विल मल्टीप्लाई टू हंड्रेड टाइम्स दिस वन ऑल्सो टू हंड्रेड टाइम्स सो सॉल्व इट यू गेट वन सिक्सटी फाइव पॉइंट सेवन फाइव इक्वल्स टू पी आई लोपन द ब्रैकेट सो इन टू टू हंड्रेड प्लस ट्वेंटी वन टू ट्वेंटी वन अपॉन टू हंड्रेड विल बी एज डेज राइट सो दिस बिकम्स वन सिक्सटी फाइव इक्वल्स टू प्रिंसिपल इन टू टू हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी वन अपॉन टू हंड्रेड एंड नेक्स्ट वॉट वी डू दिस एंटायर थिंग विल कम टू दिस साइड and it will be what reciprocated that numerator becomes denominator denominator becomes numerator so what does this become 165.75 and here it is multiplying here it will divide but we convert division to multiplication only and we reciprocate it into 200 upon 221 equals to principal p is left on this side so this solving this will give us our what principal that is a uh, principal sum or the answer basically so 221 and 165 how many times will they go let's cancel it by 13 so 221 goes how many times 1 and 91 7 times so 17 here okay this 165.75 goes one times 13 so 35 okay so 35 again two from this again nine left there so 97 goes seven times And six will be left. Ninety-one. So ninety-seven minus ninety-one, six. Sixty-five goes five. What does this become? Twelve point seven five and seventy. Again, cancel this. Seventeen. Cancel this. One and one twenty-seven. So one hundred and nineteen. How many times? Seven times. How much will be left here? Eighty-eight. Right. So eight goes with five. So it gives you eighty-five. Again, eighty-five goes five times, and no digit is there. So a zero also. Fine. So. At last, what do we get? This denominator has become one, so completely remove it. So we get zero point seven five into two hundred. That equals to the principal. Okay. So what will this be? Again, two zeros here. Okay. Let's do the multiplication. So two hundred and zero point seven five becomes what? Zero 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 one and zero zero four one again. One more zero, so basically, uh, so five ones are five, five twos are ten, and one and seven zero zero, right? So what does this become? Zero 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 one four five and one. Okay, one five and three zeros, and keep this in mind. Again, the decimal will play an important role. See, after two places, our decimal is here. This zero point seven five after two places. So in our answer, decimal point will be after two places as well. So we get one fifty. Ignore that other two zeros. So rupees one fifty equals to the principal. Okay, this becomes our final answer, or you can say the principal, whatever you want to say, right? And friends, this is all for today. If you are new to my YouTube channel, do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one. Till then, take good care of yourselves and bye bye.